The red ribbon strung throughout campus the past few days were a reminder to students and faculty of World AIDS Day that took place yesterday. With December being AIDS Awareness Month, the Spencer Museum of Art is hosting a special month-long exhibition it calls Arts Against AIDS, with portions of the gallery displaying photographs and paintings symbolizing the effects of AIDS and HIV. Here at the Spencer Museum of Art, each piece in this exhibit represents someone who's been affected by AIDS and HIV in some way. This marks the 30th anniversary since the virus was first detected. Here in Lawrence, the Douglas County AIDS Project, along with the Spencer Student Advisory Board, is hosting this inaugural exhibition. Vice President of the Advisory Board, Sean Kramer, explains the purpose behind it. Being geared towards the arts, we also really wanted to show that um, it affects the art world and it affects different types of arts. According to the Kansas Department of Health and Environment, at the beginning of the year, more than 2,600 people were presumed to be living with HIV in Kansas. Douglas County reported 95 prevalent cases of the disease. This exhibit will show the impact of HIV on the art world, as well as those affected from their earliest stages of diagnosis. We really hope to demonstrate that it sort of transcends all of these different worlds. The evening concluded with a candlelight vigil to remember those who have lost their lives or are still battling the disease. Matt Gasper, KUJH-TV News.